Hi, it's Bill Handyman up here in Northern California. How y'all doing today? Today we're looking at a Speed Queen or a Mana. Very similar to Speed Queen. And so what we have is we have a noisy startup. So it'll make a, an obnoxious noise when it starts up. And so this video is for informational purposes only. Um, if you need a professional, contact uh, your local professional. And so, this one here, we can see that the belt has got these basically hacks in it. It's falling apart. And so what this causes it to do is the idler will uh, rattle when it starts up. And once it gets going, it keeps, it'll, it'll quiet down. And there are four uh, five sixteenths uh, nuts that hold the, uh, the mount down onto the machine. And if you push the motor back, you can disconnect the belt or you can just cut it off. Um, so this one will definitely need to have a new belt. There's a couple ways we can do this is I've got some sort of wedges in here. I'm hoping it's gonna come loose, but maybe not. And I poured some hot water down here to hopefully expand the pump a little bit. And what I'm thinking I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to cut, uh, I'm gonna have to cut two of the legs to pull the water pump off. Now this is not recommended, uh, the standard, professional way to do this is to uh, bust the pump off and uh, replace the pump with a new one but what we can do is we can take and take a hacksaw and saw right here once we have the the torps it's a T25 there's three of them that hold the pump in place on the top here There's three of them that go on the top there that hold the pump in place. We need to remove those. Once we remove those, I can take a hacksaw and, and saw it right here. And we'd have to hacksaw this one off so it will saw the lower leg off of this. And then also this, this one here in the middle right there. The middle one here we'd have to hacksaw that off uh, take a hacksaw blade and just hacksaw it off right there and then when we put it back together we'll have to sort of uh, feed the feed the screw in and then put the leg back in place so uh, yeah a couple ways to do that I'm hoping I'm going to get some more water and with these wedges in here um, try and heat the pump up enough so it'll come off but otherwise you know that's what we're looking at okay so I got my handy dandy hacksaw out and sawed off this one leg up here so we got that one leg off and we'll have to pull the belt underneath these and out this way and then we'll have to hacksaw this one off and then we can pull the belt right out and uh, replace the belt that way and so if this video helped you please send me a donation I also have a how to make money in the appliance repair course it involves a year of coaching and a link to 100 repair and if you're interested in that, contact, contact me as well. Thanks again for watching.